Well, I made it back. I've been out for friggin' ever. Let's see how much money I make with that discovery data. There should be an absolute amazing amount of money here. Right now I'm at 59 million. But I, I hope I'm not overestimating what I made because I know I skipped some things. But let's see what we've got here. There's going to be a lot. I've been out a long time. Ship performed admirably. Oh. Wow. Hey, sag A, I only got 491. Everything had already been scanned anyway. What is worth so much money? Well, let's see. The Great Annihilator is worth 333,000. Let's sell some pages. Incoming message. Oh yeah, there's some money. And my name on all of that. Let's sell some more pages. Won't even let me close it, huh? Okay, that was a four million credit page. What do we got here? That's eighty six thousand. a hundred. Let's just keep selling. What I'm trying to do here is get my uh, get my influence up, my reputation up with the Empire. I want them to be nice and friendly. Six million credit page. Then I want to head to the Imperial Capital and start moving some ships around. I really wish it did have a sell all, though. to get rid of the data in case I get jumped. I've made a lot of money. I was at 59, now I'm at 92. Seven.
103. Oh yeah, making money here. Good money. Even more money. Even more money. Look at all this. 212,000 credit system. Must be neutron stars and black holes and whatnot. Some good stuff. Still wish it had to sell all. <laughs> Made over 50 million so far. Seven million credits this page. that 2 million credit system. Just everything adding up, I guess. That is wild. There's a couple items that they're worth over 300,000 each. Oh yeah, this was a good trip. Making me money. That much closer to an A-rated python. Or an anaconda. I'm not getting a conda yet though. The rebuy on that is gonna be brutal. Working toward it, though. Going to eventually get one. Here, they've got the best jump range. How much money did I make on this trip? Holy... This is a lot of money. This is 80 million. So much data. I know there are guys with billions of credits, but I feel pretty wealthy right now. Just look at all this. Just more money. I was scanning those neutron stars and black holes for days. Sinukio? What? <laughs> Seven million credit page. Holy mackerel. We're closing on a hundred million in exploration profit. Just exploration, no passengers.
So much money. Just more. Because more is awesome. Hundred and seven million or so in profit. It's amazing. Hits keep on coming. Look at all this cash, man. Low risk, good rewards. I mean, I saw a canyon where the walls were shiny, for God's sakes. A canyon where the walls were literally walls of pink ice. Another 10, oh, 7.8 million credit page. Hundred and eighty two million credits. I started this off with fifty seven million. I'm telling you, those black hole fields and the neutron star fields on both sides of the core are amazing money. And there's I don't know, God knows how many of them out there. Millions. Oh, this is amazing. So much money. They need to sell all button though, seriously. Oh my god. A hundred and forty or so million credits worth of profit. What an amazing trip. Glad I did it. Another three million. There's a bonus of two hundred and six thousand. What was that bonus of two hundred and six thousand? I have no idea what that was. I've never seen a bonus that high. That is crazy. Another four million. And this is me passing up stuff. And there it is. 203 million. I started off with 57 million. This ship performed incredibly well. The Diamondback Explorer is more specialized than the Asp, but I swear at this point it is almost the king. This thing, 53.84, yeah, I'm low on fuel right now. I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you, this thing, I'll just show it. think I've done it already, but why not? We're going to go to Starport Services. I'm going to show the breakdown. And this ship needs a little bit of love. I got no hard points, of course. There are absolutely no weapons on this thing. This thing is just... Look at, all, look at the beating I've taken. Alright. Nothing but heat sink launchers. 
I've used maybe two this whole trip due to my my being an idiot. Core internal. Maybe I could have even gone. Oh, okay. Well, could have gone 3D sensors. Maybe got a little lighter. I got no boost on this one. It's pretty light. It's got the basics, absolute basics. Best fuel scoop I can get. 4 EFMU, like I said earlier, low power. Does the job. It's slow, but it does the job. Of course, you got your surface scanners. I rock a shield generator because that's just how I do it. Got an SRV. Uh, loads of fun. This ship is amazing. Get one. If you don't have one, get one. Diamondback is fucking amazing. It works. Uh, jump range, it beats the ASP. The ASP is better multi-purpose, can carry more. But when it comes to straight exploration, this is your guy. Besides the freaking Python, uh, not Python, but Anaconda. And an Anaconda costs a lot of money. This thing will cost you about, what, 1.9 million? You can put some good parts in it, costs you a little more money. Yes, it will do the job. It will do it admirably, as you have seen. I could have taken this thing to Beagle Point. I could have done it. My endurance, my personal endurance, was not going to do it. I was just getting bored. I want to come back. I want to, you know, blow stuff up. If you hear buzzing in the background, that's my air conditioner. Um, this ship is amazing. you got to remember to turn modules off. you got to do power management. But it does the job. It does it great. I got, I was doing neutron, neutron stars. I was getting jump ranges of 205 light years, 210. Amazing ship. Go buy yourself one. I'm headed to the Imperial headquarters. I'm going to go ahead and move some ships to the Empire here. And you all have a great day. Fly safe.